All right. Uh, well, as, it, as that was 25 minutes, I will class this as a new episode, I guess. But um, welcome back, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Spider-Man Mar uh, Spider-Man 2. Actually, I lied. Alright, um, I guess we could. Uh, no, I'll, I'll unlock a new suit. Ugh, red one, no. Black, yes. Baby, that's looking ever. Oh, I might wear this one. No, 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 we're gonna wear the Miles one. Oh, oh, that looks great. Wait, Peter suits. Did we unlock it? Oh my fucking god! You no, you missed out on an opportunity to get variant versions of the suit. You missed out, Sony. You bitch. I'm not wearing that one for next episode. I wear that one for. Oh, well, I guess I wear this one for. Well, I haven't really wear this one for an episode yet, so. You're a bitch, Sony. Listen, this isn't the only stash. Ugh. Whoever next update, you like better make right up there out. an actual like color scheme for like the fucking Peter Parker for that. You better give me a color scheme. I got you. Green, green, please. Thanks, <clears throat> Green. Don't be a stranger. Green. I wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con. Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. Y. ¿Cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Whoa, Mami. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Veil in casa, and before oh. you ask me again, it's still at the end. The kettle, dude, Let's head out into the city. I found the new See form. What's going on. Shit, maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Oh my god, you can find the new. You were lucky. Oh, I got fucking. Tell me about the Peter. When can I get about the Peter? I want to play Peter Parker missions. Not Miles Morales. What is this? Miles Morales, let's play number two. Miles, pull up there. Remember, you on your way? Oh, right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. Hey, can I call you back? Cool. Sees you, Spider Man. <laughs> What's up? Wait, I can't see anything. You today. Blow them out. Don't let him you. Nope, looks like you. Alright, look. Only you can start forest fires, but more like you want to start a forest, a car fire. Off, yeah. Yeah. Ah, you... Whoa, what the... Okay. No, I got enough webs for all of you, okay? Out the trash. Yep, okay, now we're gonna take that fire. Only 30 up. seconds. Shit! Okay, since somebody listen to my idea of um you know don't Probably make don't make the time go up. To an almost exploding gas truck. Christ is the bird of Genki. You were saying? I'm up there, remember? You on your way? Right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. Wrong button. Uh, missions. Hang on, 
Oh, we've got new stuff to upgrade as well. Um, no, we just can unlock a new mile suit. Okay, cool. I don't really want to do that. I mean, like, actually, no, I'll do it later. Alright, anyway, suit deck. More health. Um, damage. Wait, what? Oh my god, that's cool. I don't know what that is. No glide for longer web wings. Nice. Oh, this game is perfect. If you don't fucking say it's good, I'm gonna actually come to your house and pour boiling milk on your head. Alright, so. Let's do miles now, so we have a lot of miles stuff. Right, so first off, I keep getting to do this. Oh, no, not that one. Um, I'm not, it's both of them. It's the whole uh, this bit, whole triangle near an enemy. I'll do that next time. City seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee or the gang that took him. Wonder if he's having better luck than me. Healing the world. Okay, that was fast. You slick bastard. Hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's dark yep. level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job too. You know, next episode I'm actually gonna. Hey, need a dance partner? I've been waiting. The world will be cleansed of your filth. Oh my God! No, no, what are you doing? Anyways, I don't have no enemies. I have no enemies. That, that can't, okay. Oh, don't take him out. I need, no, 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 I need him. No, 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 Miles, 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 Miles. Stop. No, Miles. You could have. Thanks for the assist. Just trying to keep up with you. Dude, Miles. You... <laughs> I do love it. I'm sorry. Okay, you got me up. Oh, I'm fine. I'll admit it. It's still so weird seeing, like, Miles as Spider-Man, like, swinging around. Wait, no, we Chief you. Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could God really damn, use your web fucking mission. Building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. I'm sorry, there were so many fucking missions. God damn. I have a lot of work to do, I guess. I gotta post an episode tonight as well, that's my problem. By the time you see this, is I was already posted that episode, so there's no point in me saying this. Oh my god. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who 
You know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker! <laughs> you son of a bitch. So, what do you think? Hi. It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had. Okay, we don't need to go there, you fucking asshole. And now that Says you're the one that was trying board, to shut down his own fucking this son's place project. This is really going to start cooking. Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. Of course. All right. Who is gonna be the Green Goblin? You know, seeing you boys Don't touch me. Again. Don't fucking touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Get, the, get your fucking hands off me, you prick. Right then. Have fun. I would love Get your badge out. to swing around. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you? He got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but what? when I got out, I made a few changes. Okay, what? I'm on the app. I diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research okay, aligned with the mission. How the fuck do you keep doing this? Yeah, Every time you invent a new fucking game, First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, how the fuck do you keep doing this? You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Uh -huh. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, bees? on bee predators. Beastie. Yes, be beast? Be sexual? Really acclimating to daycare. <laughs> Here, follow me. <laughs> be why do I uh why do I feel like I'm gonna Ready get to talk to Dr. Young as like a villain? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like well, this. Why project. do I feel like I'm gonna fight like Correct that not Dr. Young. Bee thing? Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. Bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Don't, fuck, don't you do this to me! Whoa, this is cool! These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were trained to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones are at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Hey, wait a minute, are you stealing my spider you know, stuff? You gotta protect the hive. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying on. Welcome to entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Anyways, thanks, Dr. Dr. Young. Dr. Young? Who the fuck is Dr. Young? I remember you. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Hey. I, I now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. Less. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Dr. Connors! Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. 
We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard? Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Okay. I guess I'll look around. Love how collaborative everyone is here. It's refreshing. So much to see here. Where do I even start? God damn it. I can't send a fucking video to my friends because they won't they're not they don't believe me that I'm playing Spider-Man 2. I should explore as much as I can right now. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. You know what? I don't need perfume. Did you see the monthly schedule update? Ah. I did, and I was very disappointed. Really? Are you fucking bastard? You absolute bastard. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. I wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Lizard Rampage. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. this some kind of radiation treatment maybe wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment let's see what's going on here maybe I can help oh yeah that would take a while I'm not sure there's time to dig in now but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later so many cool things here Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Oh, uh, okay. We have a side mission. I, I know the numbers for the yeah. entomology. Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Um, what else? Those. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. 
Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and spreads. The Emory Main Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honey... vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. There's so much to explore, but I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. Out to the Hudson Valley facility? Yeah, once. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Oh, boom, boom. Send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading? Now, oh, up to the top floor. Your energy the seems really floor? good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school, to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the. Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rebor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization. Dr. Foster up ahead. Every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. When you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. So calming and that we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. The algorithm is strict long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. <laughs> See you soon. That's precisely this way, dude. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Beautiful work, Peter. I could have done that the whole time. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Damn. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. 
You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show-offy. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Ah. Uh. Go ahead. Swipe. Swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. Come on. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. Oh, man, not I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... It's sorry, gotta put you on hold. You know, I saw an old Grand Master playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Damn. <laughs> 